What's up guys? It's Brent back here and we're going into some more Slay the Spire Library of Runa. So last time every time I hit downfall last time we played as the defect and Yeah, you guys commented kind of right. It was kind of a a cracked or a uh, a very good build um, to the people who commented uh, Yeah, it was unga bunga beat people down um, I was kind of saying it, like, kind of mentioning as we, as I was, like, answering comments while at work today. Um, yeah, it was getting really late, because I think the recording was, like, two hours-ish, two hours plus. Um, so, it was getting late when I was doing that, and then I edited, did the editing for it afterwards. Um, and, yeah, I was, by the end of it, it was just, like, beat down, let's, let's go. Uh, that's why I think I'd be a terrible, um person to do like the infinite runs because after like two hours it's like it's a slog for especially like this because there's no like there's no skipping there's no like real jump cut um jump cut opportunities kind of thing but we're going in with the watcher this time let's accept our invitation and um for your guys's um well because I, I said i would and hadn't got around to it i did end up going back i was approving comments and forgot that i had asked for you guys to send in the review to watch um, for the Library of Runa. So, I watched it. This is the one of the, it's not the character you play as, but this is the Librarian chick. Um, so, quick synopsis, I was I was watching the review that you guys recommended while eating dinner. I, I, I made some notes of what, some of the stuff I thought. Um, but main character is Roland, who is the, I think in here it's called the Black Silent, or Silence. Um, the guy we get to play at the very end. Uh, this chick is like the secondary, like the, the character that Roland works for, if I'm pretty sure, the, li the head librarian uh, type person. Um, and I'm pretty sure if I understood this right, again, I, I watched it once like while like hanging out and eating today. Um, Roland's whole job is a, I made notes on this because I found it kind of interesting. Um, his job is to lure people into the library. So he's a, uh, you get a spe specific name. Um, I don't remember. He lures people though into the library to fight for knowledge. So if you win, you get knowledge. Um, f I'm assuming knowledge to help you like fulfill your like greatest dreams. I didn't like look too closely into it. Uh, I'm also gonna do a starter rock, yeah. But, ooh, burning blood's good. But uh, if you lose, you get turned into books, which fills up the library and starts to help uh her yeah may find a place may find your book in this place um helps her to become i think it's like it's either more powerful or more human i wasn't quite sure um on the synopsis and relationship there um but they are like closely knitted uh group of characters um so my opinions on the game uh first off still beautiful it actually like the game is even though this mod is very beautiful and stuff the game also has like a, a, a incredible level of polish to it um that is very nice it's very pretty um specifically the ones i, I found i like the backgrounds for a lot of the um uh, like different levels i liked uh, specifically in the like the starting kind of title there was a joker card that i really liked um, don't know why I just thought it was very a very uh, pretty piece um, and then the other thing I really liked was on all like the sidebar and like a lot of the um, text and around the borders for the combat um, the uh, I want an eruption here but I have no no use for it besides damage he's gonna go to 24 I have 15 it's not worth it um, around all the sidebars and stuff was this like steampunky like copper and gears kind of uh, outlines, which I found very cool and liked them very much. Um, so that was like in terms of the look. Uh, mechanics wise was where I was a little less, oh, I this kind of doo doo. Uh, I'm just gonna do this. I guess we should play enlightenment here. Oh, we got a strike. Um, was where I was kind of getting lost because it's, so it's a deck builder Dice roller, ARP kind of like JRPG, I think is kind of how it was described. Um, which one, I've not really played 
a lot of JRPGs. It's not been like long term, long form story based games. Haven't always been my jam, but I did find it very interesting. I'm gonna take Tantrum here, the card I would really use. Um, so that part was where I was kind of like a little weary. Uh, interact with the box, 50 gold, transform card, and then upgrade it. Uh, we're gonna transform a strike, I guess, into a follow up. Okay, that's fine. Wake up. Um, which was so that I'm a little wary on. However, it was still very pretty. Um, the music was very nice, which I don't know if you can hear. Uh, I was recommended to turn up the music. I had it down to, I think, 5% <clears throat> for the purpose of like video recording and all that nonsense. Um, so I did turn it back up um, just to make it a little bit nicer here. Um, and it's very catchy, very poppy. Um, and I think as you travel through the different floors, I bet we'll see um, more of it, so, or a difference in it, so. I wanted to see what that was like. Extra 25 points that more damage for three round. Um, I think I'd rather have a bowling bash to get nicer here. Um, what other notes do I have? Oh, the you guys were, re were making, recommending Lobotomy Corp, which I wasn't really sure earlier today how they were quite connected. Um, but that's the previous game, which is pretty cool. Um, so we'll definitely be adding it after we finish the watch of the day on the next like full pass. So starting with Ironclad, we'll have it in. We'll play three attacks, two attacks, two attacks. Dakota Ring, interesting, but not quite what we're gonna be able to play. How early is good. Um, what other things that I have? Oh, I, the, um, one of the things I found kind of funny was that the starting, I don't know if it's the starting sequence specifically, um, but I know it was mentioned um, that in his like opening di dialogue for Roland, that he was there looking for specials on sandwiches, which I found for some reason very funny. Uh, maybe because I'm just like weird in that way, but I found it like generally funny. Uh, so that was a note I made. Next here's pretty good. I think I'll take one copy. Um, and I think that was it. Uh, it was very cool. Art's very pretty. Uh, I still haven't decided if I'm gonna pick up a copy up. I'm gonna see how much it is and see how my finances are in line, like I'm a, a normal adult person, but I'll definitely give it another look. I, I added it to my um, wish list so I can keep it like an eye on it. Um, I don't have Game Pass, unfortunately, or I just go ahead and get it and we would just try it. Um, to me, it might end up being more like stream oriented with the amount of dialogue that's in it. I'm not also sure how it would, how each like set of missions in terms of time would end up working because I do recording. Um, usually I allot like an hour and a half ish for Slay the Spire. Um, but I don't know how I could, how those would stop. Like how long each mission is? Are they very consecutive? Can you take a break in the middle? I don't know any of that yet because the gameplay that we was shown was very, was a little bit short. Um, I guess that, uh, I don't the combat or hidden compartment. Crutches are much better. Um, so there's that. I might look into a little bit more on the gameplay before I like completely make a consensus on what I'm doing there. Um, I think that's it currently. Um, it was definitely a good watch. Let's go into a draw pile. Hands from here. Into that, we're going to do this. We're going to strike, and we're going to vigilance out of it. Um, yeah, and so that that was that. Um, what we're going to do with it yet? I'm still unsure. Also, I think yeah, there's the kill. But what we're doing now is this going to continue here with the watcher. Ooh, concludes pretty good. It's not one I I would like often use because it does end your turn. Which is a very like stern punishment on a card. I think it's good enough. We don't have like a lot of like energy recycling. Knowing what I know about the late game, um, this wouldn't be as good. It would actually end up probably eating a lot of our um, like combos. But what you guys had mentioned is I missed a lot of mechanics um, for the different. This is their favorite, and I I do like the art on her. Um, a little flat here, but uh, 
what you said there was better ways to beat some of the bosses that I was going up against that I just didn't play around because we were just we were past the point of needing to learn almost we were just more powerful than they could keep up with prayer is pretty good in for mantra if you are in wrath like one road to all enemies otherwise enter wrath problem is I have two ways to enter wrath right now and no only one way to get out of it I'm almost tempted to take pressure points because I do like mark a lot it's a fun little status effect um, that like incrementally it's always like an a ender and that's what was kind of really good about uh, I don't think I want seventh left I think I'd rather remove something um, that was what was winning us I feel like the fights for the claws is that they were always stacking um, and getting stronger and stronger till they just one hit killed people Okay, um, we're gonna go tantrum here. Follow up to pay for itself. You're dead. Strike, conclude, and they're both dead. I'm getting these these patterns a little bit more than some of these enemies. Uh, empty fist is tempting, but I think for now we'll call it here. And like that, we're to the first boss. Pretty happy with how we got like getting up here. I feel like we've struggled a little bit more, but um, I feel like we did okay this time. Fairy Queen, I know we beat them before. So I'm not, so Balling Bash here is gonna be great. Okay, and then follow-up's gonna be more damage. Doing a lot of damage here. I might just protect, miracle, conclude. That does a lot of damage to all of them. Oh, okay. I forgot. I didn't read the effect. I should have held till I could actually have killed them. That's okay, though. Oh, they have thorns? It's continuing to give them vulnerability. I know. Oh, no. We have bleed. I think I am going to power through the bleed, though. Just to get some more damage off here. Because she's going to resummon, I assume. Yep. We really need, like, conclude. Tantrum sign. Vigilant. Um, we're definitely going to probably vigilance out of this. I guess we could play Tantrum first. Yeah, it's a pretty good amount of damage, and then we'll Vigilance out of that. Hopefully then we didn't waste too much potential damage. And they just killed them anyway. Huh. I thought they would be able to, so I guess I should have focused more on them. Interesting. It's fine though, we're gonna do that, we're gonna follow up here. I think we just... Might just have them. And an all out. Uh, damage to equal to your block and lose all your block. Okay, that, that works. Um, enter wrath. I just need another attack. So we protect. All in. All out. That's fine. One potion to not take a bunch of damage is totally acceptable. You turn into three damage for every card retained. I think it's still judgment. It feels more impactful. Pawn pick up, upgrade and upgraded car. I really like the solitaire here. We picked it up once before. Um, what do you become? You just become 14. You flip, which was much better. Two additional damage isn't really worth it. Oh, vigilance becoming one is kind of insane. Yeah, actually, I'm going to go for that. Okay, we're going to continue our ascent. Let's get that book. Let's continue up here. Okay. I don't have enough money to really warrant a shop yet. There's a heavily question mark path. I'm kind of for... I think I'll still pass through the shop, but I'm not too sad about it. Ugh, it's kind of like a crappy first turn. I guess the downside to the solitaire that we took was the fact that we will be probably underpowered here for a little bit. Um, this is going to enter Wrath. I want to Judgment you probably. Actually, I, don't, I probably won't even need to. If I conclude here. Oh, I can't do that. That was done on my, my turn. You can't play any other cards when you conclude. Which is obvious because that's what the card li literally does. Okay, that was my bad. Uh, follow-up's pretty good. 
Like this. Hello, shopkeep. Fire reach combat adder. Come on, I can do your deck. Nope. Get two upgrades. Actually, pretty nice. I'm kind of okay with the guidebook here, I think. I wish I could see the upgraded upgrade. I'm afraid it would lose, lose more energy, though. Ragnarok. Ooh, I want to see double upgrade Ragnarok. Okay. I can only get one. I think I still go for the guidebook, though. Judgment and Tantrum. That's not bad. And then Judgment on the second pass would be 50 on the plus plus. Pretty good. Pretty good. Hello, big bad wolf. Uh, eh, eh. Can I get you dead? Tantrum. Falling. Eruption. Oh, I am. Oh, you are dead. You have been judged, and I have judged you as dead. Uh, whenever you upgrade a card, upgrade it. I kind of want to see what this does. We create a card. We're not creating a lot of cards yet, though. It's not. There's no reason to take it, but I would love to know what the upgrade was on that. All right, let's continue up this fight. Retain a relic, curse of doubt. Retain and oh, give a card in your deck. Retain and exhaust. Oh, this is new. Uh, the machine thrums in rhythm with the heartbeat of the city. Every footstep causes cause the machine to shudder. Every offhanded comment caused it to rotate. Every wayward uh, deed dispatched its in a little. The weaver thought it was beautiful. The city creating prescripts for the people to follow as a parent giving instructions to their children. But she was not a part of it. As the weavers heard dirty to pair the prescripts, not to receive them. They really wish to be part of the city's life. See, I think we have seen this one. I just don't remember this. I know there's one that's the um, innate... And like autoplay or something similar to that. I still think I will go for the relic and the doubt here. Ooh, courier. I do like a good courier. Uh, fulfill several conditions. Obtain a special relic. I start coming out right you between uh, skill. I don't think we've done this. I think I'm going to actually fulfill the conditions. It'd be hard to live with the final person. So, encounter three normal enemies. Uh, we uh, obtain two uncommon cards. It's going to transform into a special relic. Okay, that's fine. Alright, Smith here. Get that final upgrade on Judgment. Feels pretty slick. Uh, attain an Ego card. Uh, no, I think I'm going to wait. Pretty happy with the way our deck's going right now. All right, elite fight. Ooh, we got Dorothy and her little house. Oh, 21 right off the gate, too. It's kind of steep. I can b block 12 of it, though. I get her down below 50 is the question. I don't think I could. That would be 9. We we'll bring her to 91 plus 20. No. Plus 12. No, it'd be close, though. Okay. Strike. Defend here. Oh, and we actually got off the Dakota ring. Actually, you have been judged. Dakota ring actually worked well, and I wasn't even planning to, like, do it. I need to pay more attention to it. Go bomb. Mr. Machine, get in charge every time you enter a question mark room, lose your charge. Go between non-question mark rooms, or still let our enemies gain. Actually, enemies gain 50% less block is good. Mr. Machine is also very good, uh, don't get me wrong. I'm not taking two judgments this time. I feel like that was a mistake I made last time. War paint or ancient tea set? Ancient tea set's a good way to start for bosses, but I'm kind of on this upgrade train. Yeah, two defense. I, I should have assumed. I bet I bet relics cannot upgrade cards past their original upgrade point. Oh, and this is gross. Um Go for the vigilance. Follow up, follow up. Um, dum dum dum. I guess I'll conclude. Block potion. And then conclude. Ow. Okay, so I killed this little man. Oh, I gotta devote two attacks to it. Well, they're not attacking it anyway, so actually. 
We'll do this. Block. Actually gonna block again just to go ahead and do it. And I'm gonna get slimed, I think. But yeah, they're attacking this this poor innocent child. Um I'm weak this turn. I'd like to kill them. Yeah, I can judge them, so let's Falling bash you. We'll just judge you. And then we'll end the turn. Alright. Okay. Well, up here is not bad. 14 would go up to 28. I mean, we could probably block through that, but I don't really want to. Not enough extra damage here to facilitate it, I don't think. We'll just take nothing and continue. Ah, yes, the healing. Um, okay. This is a pretty good turn. Tantrum. Falling Bash. Strike. Slime. Vigilance. Get him down just then. So there go down to one more. And then, yeah, we can just finish it off here. Follow up. Strike. Conclude. They're all dead. Not too bad. And that was... Oh, that's considered a normal enemy fight. Interesting. Whenever you block damage exactly... No. Yuzu Bracelet is going to be much better for us. Alright, let's look at our card here. Oh, we just did that. Dog came in and started slurping up some water, so... I had to pause for a second, but we go... Ooh, we've not seen this one. Wizard of Oz. As you navigate the twists and turns of the Labyrinthic Library, you come across a curious book with a curious cover. It flies open before you beckoning you to peer within his pages. I did not see what the card was. Did it add the card to our deck? Nope. Should have hovered over it, apparently. The wizard spoke to the scarecrow, seeking wisdom. I will give you a brand new brain full of pins and needles. All I ask is for you to swear loyalty to me. Remove a card, become cl cursed with clumsy. Upon pick up loose, seven max HP, the first two cards you draw each turn. Cost zero until played. Okay, yeah, false present. So we're gonna remove doubt for that. Keep seeing stuff. Like on the side. Uh, the wizard spoke and the woodsman seeking a heart. I will give you. I will give you a silk heart stuffed with sawdust. All I ask you is to swear to loyalty to me. Uh, false present. Oh, refuse throne. And put all non status non cursed into your sauce pile. And, and give them a zero. I don't want that. Um, no, I mean, I'll take two max HP. I assume. And the wizard spoke to the lion seeking courage. I will give you a drought filled with boundless courage. I see you just swear a loyalty to me. Alright, lose 50 code. Obtain a potion. I want to see y'all to the end. Oh, and that- Oh, we continue. We just spoke to the girl seeking to return home. I will give you a pair of silver shoes to take you wherever you desire. All I ask is you for, to swear loyalty to me. You have a card deck plus one to its damage and exhaust. Huh. Plus one and exhaust. Do I have anything that already exhausts? Huh. Right. Accept the present. So this is false present. Uh, Pump pick up lose seven max HP. The first two card, two cards, are more refusals than acceptance. Okay, interesting. So we're gonna take the false present, and now we are down to less max HP, but should help our setup turns a lot. I could cut across our- I think I'm gonna go this way. I was thinking- never mind. A shop to remove a card could be very good. Um, that's what I want to do. Double checking everything. Yeah, nothing else here seems- Flurry of Blows is good, but I don't think we're doing that quite correctly. Uh, let's remove that clumsy here. And I think that's everything we want currently. Let's proceed here. Ah, the pianist! Ah, uh, there's the one I was thinking. There's the innate and autoplay. Or we could take pain. I'd rather do. <laughs> okay. Dead Brant. 
Uh, we might burn that at rest sites because I do not. I'm not great with Dead Branch. Not my best card. Uh, but free defense here. Is it if you play three? Yeah, and I don't want to be. It's frail, right? Yeah. Well, I'll play one more. That's fine, actually. The downside is I'm frail this turn, but again, it ends up not mattering. Uh, Tantra. Uh, follow up. My pain. Pain is annoying. Um, do I, I'll intercom. Try and do that. Yep, because, yeah, big attack this turn. I probably can finish them, actually. Tantrum. Follow up. Eruption. Pressure points. That was it. I still had to conclude, too, if I needed it. Uh, no. I'm looking for powers. That's something I haven't seen a lot of. Uh, lose dead brands. Obtain a special relic. Free action. I think this gives you region. Whenever you enter a rest site, start the next time at five region. Yeah. Which I am totally a fan of. Okay. Enter wrath and do so that's 18 damage. That's a pretty good upgrade there. If I had more pressure points, I would think about doing that. Mm -hmm. I think conclude AOE would be better. Yeah. Let's do that for now. Speed here. Yep, because I, I was thinking this thing had some little minions. Uh, falling bash. Oh, we have the stupid pain. Defend. We get the region though, so I'm going to continue going through. I am not going to eruption here though. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of damage if I do that. And we have the death potion if we sincerely need it. Are they still cards? Skill where some other creature steals a card. Which loses HP. Put the stolen card into my hand. There's Judgment and Tantrum, and you have a Defend. And I kind of want my cards back. Judgment back. And this one's. Oh, I, I want to hit these little. little goobs. I wonder if I Judgment them if that considers killing them. If I do 50 damage to Ozma. Oh, and she blocks for them. Okay. But it's only half the block that it should be. Okay. Um, ugh. Strike. Follow up. Oh, there's Conclude. That'll be a good finisher to this turn. Um, ugh. I say, because he's four. Problem is I can't Conclude then Judgment. Let's just Protect. Then we're going to Miracle. Then we're going to Conclude. Judgment will come back around eventually. We are going to take a wallop, though, from Ozma. Which I kind of expected here. We're still regening, which is good. Oh, and we drew a bunch of those cards. Oh, Oblivion. Interesting. I was not expecting that. Follow up on you. Eruption here. Let's go ahead and weaken her. Because that's a lot of damage coming in. Regen's been great, but at the same time, uh... I do not want to take that with damage. Uh, now we're paralyzed. Oh, not great. Uh, you have a bunch of my cards I want. Pressure point, you. Defend here. Alright, there's all the regen gone. Honestly, you almost have to leave up these little skeletons to draw cards. Alright, I'm gonna judge you. She did not take any of the damage. That's very unfortunate. Okay. Good to know, I suppose. Ugh. Getting low on life here. Alright, um... Oh, uh, farts. I kind of need to defend some, because 26 is no nothing to scoff at. They actually will kill me if I'm... If I do nothing here. I think we go... What are you carrying? Yeah, you're carrying a bunch of cards. Let's strike. Follow up. Oh, we had the pain in there too. I didn't realize. Right, they have judgment now. Down to eight. Oh man. Doing four. Okay. We're stacking up it. Stacking up the uh, mark, but she should be attacking this turn. I mean, 
death potion would be like, oh my goodness, 30. Yeah, we're dead. Super duper dead. Yep, can't do that. This is only 12. We'll lose 12 health. Yep. I'm going out on my own terms. Ojma got us. Floor two, we can do another. Another lap. I don't know if the fact that I wasn't doing damage to the little creatures ended up mattering. I don't know if I would have killed her either way. The fact that judgment didn't work on them and didn't do any damage to her was kind of annoying, but is what it is. Let's choose an ego card. 26 to all enemies. Take six damage if your HP is at 50%. Below 50%. This card costs zero. Eh. Draw one at the start of your turn, gain one energy, draw one card, and freeze one card. Or um, at the start of your turn. Uh, I mean... Latia is very good. I'm gonna try it again. It is what we used last time for to great success. Um, right side... Ooh, here's a fun little path here. Okay. There's a lot of shops, though. Early shop should be fine. That's fine. Hello, my friend. Let's go Latia. Double strike. And then defend. Get that setup going. First chest will be zero. We gotta keep that in mind. Vigilant strike. Alright. I guess we could double vigilant. I mean, double eruption. But I can't see how that would... Be very like profitable to me specifically. Uh, da -dum -dum -dum. Oh wait, yeah, you're just dead. I was trying to math it out in my head. Death potion, good try. But I return out of smite to your hand. I'm okay with that. Smites are pretty high damage. Ugh, you are. You guys kind of suck. Um, but what I was saying, smites are pretty high damage cards. Um, and what I like about them is uh, you can then upgrade them and such. Plus they're just given to you. You always have them to play if something's exhausting. All that kind of stuff. Oh, gross. Oh, and you're all attacking this turn. Lovely. Um, let's miracle Thea here. To double defend. And then... I really just want to smite someone. Just for the fun of it. Ouch. Smites are 12, so 6. That could have been more damage, but it's fine. Take five more here from the butterflies. Now this is 24. Gotta remember that ordering on what cards to play. Uh, second one is not necessary. Balling bash is good though, or bowling bash. Keep saying balling. What is this? Combs heart, raise your HP by 100 and become unable to obtain new relics for the entire run. Ooh, that is not great. I mean, it's cool, but not necessary for what we're doing. Let's get a strike out of here. Continue along here. Definitely an interesting relic. I don't think I've ever seen it, so. Always interesting to see those ones. Double defend here. Ow. Um... Do this, then we're gonna go double strike, miracle out of defend here. And then this should be an easy Yep, as long as we have another card. Easy turn. None of these are necessary. I thought about calm, but I don't think we need it. Shh. Rather remove another card. Playing it very very safe. I don't need something that's going to put a, like a timer on this dying. Um, refund one. Very good. Allows us to play it a little easier. Hello, Loreen. Yeah, let's Latia. Oh. <laughs> Falling Bash, Miracle, Vigilance, I think. In, okay. If we get Eruption, we can end up using that the better success or not. Ow. I'm gonna paralyze this turn. 
Ugh, I mean, we kind of want to play this. Get a little Vigilance back. We need to upgrade Eruption, I think, to make it a little better. Battle Helm here is... Oh, I didn't mean to play that twice. That's fine. We should have played the other strike, but it's fine. 13 here. Does suck, but we can rest. Oh, there. Yep, double smite. What I was kind of afraid of. 18. We have exactly 18. I will have to death potion her if I'm not able to specifically kill her right here. I cannot. Take 12, but we're, we survived. Our Carter's retained. It is. Is the smite, uh, my, they do, they do retain. No, so establishment's good. Oh, I need a rest. I think I'm going to cut across now. I was going to go for all these elites and stuff up here, but I think I'm going to go more question mark. Uh, we'll accept the gift. Let's see, what is this? First of all, whenever you remove a car, remove an upgraded card from your deck, upgrade two random cards in your deck. Okay. That's actually not bad. There's the empty chest. Let's rest here. Make that to good use. Get out of here, Spire Clo Spire Co Gremlin. Gosh, words. Um, Latia here is fine. I don't want a double establishment, unfortunately. We'll double strike here and establishment. We didn't set up anything for the next turn, which is kind of sad, but that's fine. Oh, I don't. I wanted some block here, really. Okay, um, establishment here. Right, yeah, that's not that great. Ow. Okay. Double smite. I'm actually gonna vigilance here. If I had another attack, we could just kill them. But yeah, I was afraid. Actually, yeah, never mind, it didn't matter. Fruit juice. Oh, drink that. Okay. Um, actually, give me one protect. With the establishment, it protects pretty good. Okay. Hello, friends. I guess we're doing this. No AoE is unfortunate here. Because they hurt a lot. Okay. We can kill one, but it's still going to suck. Do that. Very fun one back. Who's doing the most damage? You? My friend, you are now dead. Miracle back to protect. That's what we got. This thing's gonna attack, the spider bud's gonna attack us next turn. So I would like to kill it, but I need more. Oh, we're webbed here. Webbed. Uh, double defend. Defend, battle helm. That's enough to get us down to four. Ouch. Okay. I mean, I can kill all the spiders. So, strike, strike, might get a slime out of here. Kill a four, but we we have a protect, which we can double here. I don't need to. I don't think. Going for the biscuits. Yep. Forty-eight damage. There we go. Fasting's good. Man, it is not worth it right now. Oh, we have another fight. <laughs> I just want that rest. Uh, establishment here is good. Honestly, let's get one of you out of here. And then... I think I go ahead for the eruption here. With the hope that I can get out of it this coming up turn. Or kill them. Both are good options, yep. You're dead. You are getting poked to death now. Uh, we had a burns in our hand. Oh, the burns. And I have no attacks. Lo oh, 44 damage. Not doing that. Protect. Um, I'm still taking damage. Okay. We're still fine. Oh, he blew himself up. Not expecting that, but I'll take it. Another bowling bash. Rest. All right. Not as optimistic this time, but... We fought this guy a couple times. So we know kind of some of his quirks. Get set up here. He gets his musical ring out. Uh, let's... Yeah. 
I think. Double smite. Establishment. And then, yeah, we're gonna take 10 here. Not great, but it was necessary for for the setup. Okay. Uh, I kind of want to light the the smite start stacking up, so we're gonna do it that way. Then we're going to protect, defend. Smites are gonna come become free. Oh, ow! Not fun. Oh, both these chairs here. Nice. Um, da dum. Okay, eruption. Double smite. Smite. Um, take two damage. I want you out of here. I have the free protect, but I don't think I want to stand this. Let's get that out. Okay, these do become free though over time, which is good. Okay, get that out of here. So even though I retain it for a little bit, let's do that. Oh, I lost my Latia because of that. I didn't think about when I did that. Um, 14 coming in, I have to defend. I should play this chair and I guess I'll bolt bash. Ow. Ooh, yep. Kind of what I was thinking. Oh my. Ah, and I wasted everything right there. Oh, something in my hand killed me. I don't even know what it was. Maybe a burn or the pain. I have to go back and look. Bad start. I'm surprised we got to the first boss. We're learning the patterns a little bit more. Um, but I hope you guys did enjoy. Um, I hope you guys liked the discussion at the beginning. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I could do more like talky talk stuff like that. Um, I have a hard time focusing and talking. Um, if not, one of them starts sucking. Um, usually the gameplay, because I do enjoy talking. 102, it happens. But we're, we're learning. We did get to the second boss, the first round, which was much more powerful. Um, next episode, which will be in two days from whenever this comes out, hopefully. Um, assuming I'm not late or something. Um, I will probably add the lobotomy mod, since it's been requested. Um, and we'll do another pass. And let's keep going. Um, I'll consider getting Library of Runa. Uh, I'm still like trying out other games on the channel when I have free time, so we'll see. I'm in no hurry to like put something in that I don't think will be fun. Um, also, we'll just watch and see how it goes. This has been a lot of blo a lot of fun. Again, thanks everyone for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. Um, the sport's been amazing. Um, I always like telling you guys that because it still surprises me to see um, the amount of people that come out and watch. So, thanks again. Thank you to the people commenting. Um, there's a few of you that are really consistent and every time I see a new comment I'm excited just to read it and answer it because it's exciting to see you guys watching but that's going to do it for this episode guys I hope you guys did enjoy if you did hit the like button subscribe if you want to see more and I'll see you guys next time bye guys